Hello, Dr. Dave Highmarsh, GP Templates, with prospective medical record access now going well online. You may come to a realization there is more stuff that you just want to keep away from the patients because it may sort of affect uh, them without having a discussion with them first. You may have had a couple of SEAs about this as well. So I'm going to show you three areas that you can hide a medical record, the medical record, i.e. pathology results, letters, and also consultations themselves. So let's jump over to system one and we'll do pathology first. So I've got pathology result, uh, result here. I'm going to say mark report as reviewed and then when we get to this screen we need to unclick visible on online record access and that's it as simple as. When we're on letters once we're dealing with a letter we need to go over onto the left hand panel and have a look at visibility and this gives us three options really we can have normal, private or safeguarding relevant. So again ticket to private not part of shared cared record. When we've got a uh, consultation that we want to hide. I select the one that I've done here and I've just put a very brief one saying potential concerns and if you click make sure you click on the top box itself okay so I'm clicking where my name is right click and this gives us a couple of options and then again it's similar to when we've got letters you've got mark event as private or, or safeguarding relevant and if you do it as a sort of private that will make sure that it's sort of off from there it will give you this pop-up just to say that effectively as with all of them that you need to be very careful of why you are doing this and that it's sort of that you've got a policy in place in the practice level as to why you would want to hide some of this patient's information dr dave Heimarsh, gp templates little quick tip for you and i hope that helps